The FBI now creating a nationwide database to learn about how civilians interact with police officers. A new law already requires a report when somebody dies during an interaction with police, but now the Department of Justice wants to know more about officers' use of force. Rich Edson is live from Washington with the latest. And Rich, so why is the FBI taking this fairly aggressive step now? What with civilians dying after contact with police officers, prompting protests and riots in cities like Ferguson, Baltimore, and Milwaukee, the federal government has unreliable, incomplete information on how many Americans die interacting with police or in police custody. FBI Director James Comey recently called that lack of data embarrassing and ridiculous. So Attorney General Loretta Lynch, with the power of a new law, says the federal government will collect and publish that information. When it comes to non-lethal use of force, the things that can really have just as corrosive an effect, there's no statute requiring the collection of that data. So we've spent a lot of time through the FBI working with local law enforcement and tribal law enforcement, I would say, um, to come up with national consistent standards. Until now, states individually had drafted similar initiatives, Greg. Rich, is this mandatory and widespread? Do all police departments have to comply? Well, the federal government has limited authority in local policing, except when it comes to funding. This law allows the administration to withhold federal funds or fine a department if it refuses to report when somebody dies interacting with police. However, this new law only gives the administration the authority to require police departments to report these incidents if a civilian dies. So the Department of Justice is creating a voluntary database where it's requesting local departments share information on any use of force. Participation is up to each department. Nothing in the law requires they do so. All right, Rich Edson, live in Washington. Rich, thanks.